Hi there, my name is Jordan Tasha from The Lesson Space and welcome to another video in the Lesson Space video tutorial series. In this video, we're gonna be going through leading mode, a powerful mode that allows you as a teacher to control exactly how your space works for your students, whether it's blocking students from your space, making their videos go off, turning their mics off, asking them to unblock their video or asking their mic to go back on, managing banned users, or even locking certain tabs and not letting your students modify other tabs as well. So there's a lot to go through, let's get through it. And as always, remember to check out the Lesson Space video tutorial series over on our YouTube channel. The first thing I want you to notice with leading mode is this little icon here. If this icon is here and you can hover over it to confirm, this means that you are currently leading the space. Click it to see a number of useful options, and if this toggle is on, we are in leading mode, which you can switch off. Let's go through what we can do as a leader of your space. First, we have control over which video layout mode is currently activated for ourselves and all of our participants. Right now, we are on floating video mode. If I want my students to pay more attention, let's say to the content on our space, we can change the overall layout mode to video sidebar mode. And of course, if we want our students to pay more attention to me and my face, we can switch to video grid, which allows you as the teacher to see all your students laid out correctly and for all your students to see your face. We can also manage tabs as a leader, whether it's preventing students from editing, closing or deleting tabs that are in your space. To enable and disable all of these features, we can right click on any of our tabs and see a drop down of our options. Disallowing changes makes a tab read only, meaning you as the leader can only chain, make changes to that tab. We can also prevent the tab from being deleted and we can also rename the tab as a leader. There is also a global read only tab toggle over here, which makes all our tabs unable to be edited by any of the participants except yourself. As a leader, we can also control our whiteboard tabs a bit more than non-leaders. We can scroll up and down to control the viewport of our whiteboard, or rather what the students can see on a whiteboard, which can be extremely useful for very large whiteboards. And if we want to congratulate our students as a leader for their good work, we can use the fireworks emoji located in the bottom right by hovering over or clicking the chat and accessing the emojis menu. The last thing we can do as a leader is manage students in a very controlled manner. Click here to go to our next video tutorial to explain in depth how as a leader, we can manage students in ways such as muting, blocking video, kicking students from spaces and managing lists of our students. And that's it for leaders mode. We really hope you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next video. Be sure to check out all our other videos on our Lesson Space YouTube channel.